Cat Racing. Uh, Rafer Hazel jumped out nicely. She's going to fire through and grab the lead. Put it out all against man. Coming around the outside is Corbon Clock. Now the rail opening up for Got to Go Ace. That'll hit the line strong. Around the corner, uh, Rafer Hazel, but Got to Go Ace has got that gap through on the inside. Uh, Rafer Hazel coming back, but Got to Go Ace, I think, got there narrowly from uh, Rafer Hazel out wide of Corbon Clock. Then a power token. Further back the field, all against me. Be prepared was back in the rear group there with. Uh, Got all, Homebush awesome, but also to cover back there as well. And racing, chase the stars out, what enough showing a bit there, Gracie Race is going to whip across and grab the lead, uh, they're followed up there also, getting around the outside, Peps, Potter length of two, back down on the inside, you know Nosy, no sign of either cunning plan, but around the corner, Gracie Racy in front, Gracie Racy and box draw didn't worry in the end it got home to beat chase the stars coming solidly then you know nosy they're followed on the inside another another out wider either cunning plan hit the line well but far too late then peps pot back we go there towards the tail some of fun Ready. And racing. Son of Grace about second or third away. Charlie's pal best out round the outside. Verita shows up. Uh, they're followed by Son of Grace trying to get around the outside. They're followed a length of two back. Ruby Leo then Witchwood Rose. They turn the corner. Getting away though, Verita. Verita with a good break here will beat uh, Son of Grace. Up the third, maybe Massar Joni. It's tight though with Groovy Leo. There followed Witchwood Rose. Down on the inside, Go Patch. And they're followed there by uh, the next one there. Well, Charlie's pal was back. And also back there, Pandora Doll. Set and racing. Field away now, and one of the best out was a power stretch. It's followed out then on the inside by Cognac Diamond. Racing up the third is Corbon Polly. Wagon Wheels getting nice and handy now as they race their way down the back. A length of two round the outside. Choose to love. Down the back they travel. Power stretch has got away now. And it's out by about three. Uh, they're followed by Cognac Diamond. A length and a half back there to Corbon Polly. Wagon Wheel is still running on around the corner. Getting away though, a power stretch. This is going to be a big run. A power stretch has got the money set. And I think Cognac Diamond Wagon Wheel was flying. They're followed by Corbon Polly. Uh, back we go, choose the love out wide on the track, Casino Black. And they're followed by Aspro Annie. And that was back with a par with Jake towards the tail.
and racing. Homeless Charo, slow also, slow there, Botany Craig. And down on the inside, uh, getting a run through at that point is Connolly, but darting around the outside, favourite to Marjo, grabs the lead. They followed a Cuckoo Muppet. They turn the corner, but getting right away here to Marjo. Will beat Connolly and, oh, it's close. Connolly or on the outside of Cuckoo Muppet, close in the end. They followed further back, Charles Federick out wide of Still Mulberry Macro. They followed a length of two back there by Mustang Mags. Home was Charo back in that rear group, and so too was Botany Craig. Racing. One of the best out, Miss Isabella, and Carrots Prince has gone straight to the lead. Whoosho, away it goes. You can run to the back of the toad, I would say. And Carrots Prince out by three or four there, followed there by Botany. Kevin gives chase round the outside, uh, running into it rather strongly. There is Mulberry Brook. Little Gap, the others headed out wide on the track there by our hope. A length of two back then. They were followed by Seraphine Jill on the corner. Carrots Prince, there's only one danger. No, there's no danger. Carrots Prince is getting away again. Carrots Prince by five. Mulberry Brook second, eight lengths away, third, Miss Isabella. Down the outside, Noisy Leo, they're followed by. Our hope down on the inside, Botany Kevin never came into it. Seraphine Jill, and that was back there towards the tail with a hoka Sandy. Ready and racing, car bootle slow out wide on the track, TV Gidget best out, followed up there by Emily Patrick, uh, getting around the outside, uh, they were followed up there too by Flute Elise, but get the others, now Starburst Benny's not in this, it's going to run near enough to last, up they come, and still, oh no, over the top, I think Emily Patrick might have dived and got up in the last stride to beat TV Gidget, uh, they're followed back, we go there to car bootle no pity, ran on, further back there we go too, uh, towards the tail there, another stone, also back there would have been uh, your favourite, Starburst Benny and uh, Flew to Lease back there with Winsome Extra. And racing, she's out fairly well, Speedy Kazza. Best out though was Chevy Chevelle, shows more. Uh, Mulberry Hunter, Speedy Kazza up the third there, followed by Ginger Jam, round the turn out of the straight they run. A length of two back there, they were followed, getting the rails run now as Barnaby Bell looks dangerous. Down the back they go, but in front here is Chevy Chevelle. Uh, three lengths away, Speedy Kazza. Barnaby Bell is running third, a length and a half back, Ginger Jam, the rest are headed by here, 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 but up they come. Still in front, Chevy Chevelle. Barnaby Bell trying hard, Chevy Chevelle. Chevelle, Barnaby Bale, Speedy Kazza. They're followed here, here, here. Back we go, Ginger Jam. They're followed by Mulberry Hunter. And that was back there in the running with Draco Baxter and Wandy on in.
racing, Mick and Paddy fairly away. Best out would have been on the inside, Gil Racer. Uh, they're followed up there by Billy Buggins. Uh, a length and so back there to another star along the rail. It's getting the rails run now. Now, Mick and Paddy's recovered a bit after missing the way. It's back in about fourth place. We'll charge home along the rail. They're followed out wider still by Opulent. Uh, back we go in the pack there too. Rocky Baxter out wider. Ahoka Frenchy on the corner. Getting away though, Gil Racer dashes away. Up they come down the outside. Ahoka Frenchy flying but too late. Gil Racer will beat Ahoka Frenchy. They're followed by Opulent. Close up there, another star. And right beside that was Mick and Paddy. And out wider still, Rocky Baxter. They're followed by Millie Muggins. Uh, that was back there with running Jonah towards the tail. set and racing down on the inside, Starburst plants jump nicely, but not as quick as Trans Tasman. Favourite straight to the lead. Round the outside, showing up there, Jack's a jewel. They're followed off the track. Arcaden down on the inside. Corbin Flipper around the corner. Trans Tasman monstered now by Jack's a jewel. Trans Tasman comes again and wins it. Trans Tasman, Jack's a jewel. They're followed by Starburst Blanche third. Further back there we go along the inside. Corbin Flipper out wide to make your point. Winston Who was next, and towards the tail of Cuckoo Bobo. Racing in the Carnival Campus, and uh, the best out in the middle there would have been a Power Patch, but showing up there, Gogo Rioli, and now driving along the inside, Corbin Rene. But Gogo Rioli's got too much speed. Round the outside, going up there, a Power Wally. He's a big threat from there. Down the back they go, and it's Gogo Rioli, a Power Wally. Three away, Corbin Rene. Uh, they're followed down on the inside there, behind them by a Power Bro, running on out wide, Corbin Keisha around the corner. Gogo Rioli still kicking, it's kicking too hard, or get the prize. Second and we've got Corbon Keisha a Power Bro to third at Power Wally. Just a run, he dropped out of it. They followed further back there. Shalana Star never really got into it. A power patch was wider. And towards the tail, Gypsy Hunter. And racing, no pride about third or fourth away. Best out would have been in the centre, Wanya. And driving along the inside, Corborn Chief. And coming around the outside, very wide on the track, Aversion. Now look at no pride, it's got the gap. Corborn Chief, no pride, your two favourites. But up they come, no pride has zipped through to grab the lead. Or big Corborn Chief. Aversion third, there followed Turbo Tundra. Further back, there we go to Wanya. A little gap to the others, headed by Wandy Miller. And that was back with Okuku Lillian vitalised back there as well. about the jump. Ready. And racing. 
down on the inside, Wandy Gaylene came away smartly as she normally does, but there's Swapan getting around now. They're followed uh, back. We go there too. Uh, the next one there along the inside, Kenny's Comet. Leader's got a big lead. Wandy Gaylene, they won't catch her. She's well clear. Swapan there. We've got the Black Tank to third, just uh, Kenny's Comet the outside. Further back there, Corbin glowing back last. There would have been another street. Of course, the two late scratchings of the five and the six. And racing field away here and uh, one of the best out is going to be out wide on the track of power sister is also followed out there by true classic favorites grab the lead early out uh, there followed by a Lamore down on the inside behind them Gelber John Billy brand but up they come and away goes true classic will beat Opawa's sister of Lamore they're followed back we go there to a hoka heart of them late further back there we go to foggy storm that's followed further back there by uh, Billy Brand, Jimmy C, and Gilbert John would have been back in that rear pack as well. And racing, one of the best out, full of pride, the inside and showing up there. We've got uh, right round the outside, don't call me. And that goes to the lead, followed up by Wally Wood up there as well. Then we go back, Syrup's Girl, further out on the track. Yaps to Jill, up they come, don't call me, trying hard, Wally Wood. Don't call me, Wally Wood. Then we've got Syrup's Girl down on the inside, Yaps to Jill. Out wider still, ZK Man, further back there we go too. Uh, full of pride, and that was back there towards the tail with Red Eye Max and Homebush. Esme would have been back there as well.